What's up everybody? Today I'm gonna to be doing a little riff on one of our more popular videos on this channel, the Keto Chaffles. Only this time we're gonna be making primal, paleo, keto-friendly spaghetti waffles. Now I know it sounds a little bit strange, but you're gonna to have to trust me on this one. Uh, to get started, you're going to take one egg, a quarter cup of mozzarella cheese, two tablespoons of almond flour, and one scoop of the Primal Kitchen unflavored collagen peptides. Now in the keto chaffle recipe, a lot of people ask, is the collagen peptides totally necessary? And for that recipe, I'd say no. But for this recipe, uh, the collagen definitely does help absorb some of the water that comes with the zucchini noodles. Um, so if you can, I would definitely add them to this recipe. Uh, I also tried Miracle Noodles and those didn't work out so well. They just had a little bit too much water. So those never really stuck together. They made my waffle iron a mess. Um, you could try other noodle varieties if you like, but uh, zucchini noodles definitely work well for this. And so I'm gonna add my cup of zucchini noodles. I'm just going to mix that all together with a fork. Next, I'm going to take my waffle maker. I've got a Dash brand waffle maker here. I think I got this at Target, but you can probably also get it on Amazon. Uh, I'm going to give it a quick spray down with some of the Primal Kitchen avocado oil spray. And then I'm going to add the mixture to the waffle maker. I'm gonna use a fork to spread it nice and evenly. I don't want any gaps. I want all the zoodles spread evenly across the waffle maker. I'm gonna shut it and I'm gonna cook it for about four, probably five minutes. Uh, don't get impatient and open the waffle maker earlier or else it will split apart in half and you're gonna have a, a huge mess on your hands. So be patient, wait that four minutes, around four or five minutes, check it. If it's looking good, I think this one is, you can remove it using a fork and voila, there you go. You can eat these as is and they're gonna be delicious, but really what is spaghetti without sauce and meatballs? And so I'm going to top mine with some Primal Kitchen pasta sauce. I've got the tomato basil on hand, so I'm gonna use that. I had some leftover meatballs. I threw a couple of those on top and then I covered the whole thing in a little bit of Parmesan cheese. Now you could do other variations. You could use an Alfredo sauce and some grilled chicken or maybe the vodka sauce and some Italian sausage. A lot of possibilities, just giving you some ideas to get started. And you can pick up any of the Primal Kitchen pasta sauces. You can get them all at primalkitchen.com. If you use the code HELLO20, you'll get 20% off your entire order. Just a little thank you for checking out our channel. Uh, we appreciate you watching. Be sure to subscribe, and I will see you next time.